Applications of Inorganic Chemistry in the Production of Bearing Materials Inorganic chemistry has found numerous applications in the production of strong and durable materials. This branch of chemistry deals with the synthesis and study of inorganic compounds, we Ically characterized by their lack of carbon-hydrogen bonds and their ability to form ionic bonds. In this article, we will explore the various applications of inorganic chemistry in the pro. Ically characterized by their lack of carbon-hydrogen bonds and their ability to form ionic bonds. In this article, we will explore the various applications of inorganic chemistry in the pro. Materials that can withstand significant mechanical stress One of the most widely used applications of inorganic chemistry in material production is the synthesis of ceramics. Ceramics are typically made by heating a mixture of inorganic compounds T. Tritures, causing them to undergo a chemical reaction and form a solid material. Ceramics are known for their high strength and resistance to wear making them ideal for use in applications. Tritures, causing them to undergo a chemical reaction and form a solid material. Ceramics are known for their high strength and resistance to wear, making them ideal for use in applications. Utting tools, engine components, and armor. Another important application of inorganic chemistry in material production is the production of cement. Cement is a key ingredient in concrete, which is used extensively in construction. Say, to by heating limestone and other materials to high temperatures, causing them to undergo a chemical reaction and form a powdered material. When mixed with water, this powder forms a paste tea. To by heating limestone and other materials to high temperatures, causing them to undergo a chemical reaction and form a powdered material. When mixed with water, this powder forms a paste tea. S over time, creating a strong and durable material. Inorganic chemistry is also used in the production of metals. Metals are typically produced by extracting ores from the earth and then refining them to remove impurities. Inorganic chemistry A role in this process, as it is used to control the chemical reactions that occur during refining. This helps to ensure that the resulting metal is of high quality and has the desired mech. A role in this process, as it is used to control the chemical reactions that occur during refining. This helps to ensure that the resulting metal is of high quality and has the desired mech. Pretties. One specific application of inorganic chemistry in the production of metals is the production of steel. Steel is an alloy of iron and carbon, and is known for its high strength and durability. It chemistry is used in the production of steel to control the composition of the alloy and to ensure that it has the desired mechanical properties. This includes controlling the amount of C. Ick chemistry is used in the production of steel to control the composition of the alloy and to ensure that it has the desired mechanical properties. This includes controlling the amount of C. He alloy, as well as the presence of other elements such as chromium and nickel. In addition to ceramics, cement, and metals, inorganic chemistry is also used in the production of composite materials. Composite materials are made by combining two or more different moderi. Aid a new material with unique properties. Inorganic compounds are often used as the reinforcing material in composite materials, providing strength and durability to the final product. Aid a new material with unique properties. Inorganic compounds are often used as the reinforcing material in composite materials, providing strength and durability to the final product. One example of a composite material that uses inorganic chemistry is fiber-reinforced polymer, FRP. FRP is made by combining a polymer matrix with reinforcing fibers, typically made of glass. 
N. Inorganic chemistry is used to control the chemical reactions that occur during the production of the polymer matrix, as well as to ensure that the fibers are properly embedded within the N. Inorganic chemistry is used to control the chemical reactions that occur during the production of the polymer matrix, as well as to ensure that the fibers are properly embedded within the The resulting material is strong, lightweight, and resistant to corrosion, making it ideal for use in a variety of applications, including construction, aerospace, and automotive. In addition to the applications mentioned above, inorganic chemistry also plays a crucial role in the production of glass. Glass is a non-crystalline solid material that is often used in the ring of windows, lenses, and other optical components. Inorganic chemistry is used in the production of glass to control its properties, such as its melting point, refractive index, and their ring of windows, lenses, and other optical components. Inorganic chemistry is used in the production of glass to control its properties, such as its melting point, refractive index, and their